in this video we are going to discuss symmetry of the signal. So, here symmetry refers to so even symmetry or odd symmetry or half wave symmetry. So, which symmetry the signal is satisfying is very important. So, that will affect the Fourier series representation also. For example, if you are given with Fourier series representation for a signal to represent Fourier series representation of a signal, first you need to check for symmetry if they given any waveform. Why? Because if you know which symmetry that is related to, you can easily get, you can easily represent Fourier series representation by neglecting some coefficients. Why? Because if a signal is satisfying even symmetry, then definitely we are having only even components or even harmonics. That means all curves terms will be there. So, in our trigonometric Fourier series representation, what are the even symmetric terms means cos terms. So, we are having only cos terms. So, now coming to odd symmetry. So, here we are having only sign terms. If the signal is satisfying odd symmetry in the Fourier series representation also, it is having only sign terms. So, now coming to half wave symmetry. So, if you are having half wave symmetry, then definitely, so that half wave symmetric wave may be either e, uh, even signal or even symmetric signal or odd symmetric signal. By satisfying half wave symmetry in your signal, if that is even symmetry, so and it is also satisfying half wave symmetry and you are having all odd harmonic cos terms you are having. That means cos omega naught t, cos 3 omega naught t, cos 4 omega naught t terms will be presented in the Fourier series representation. That means you are limiting the representation terms in Fourier series representation. So, here if any signal satisfying odd symmetry and half wave symmetry, then in your Fourier series representation, you are having only sign terms that is also odd harmonic sign terms. So, half wave if any signal satisfying half wave symmetry means, so definitely whatever the harmonics are there, all ha odd harmonics are going to present. So, now you can see the equations. So, if x of t is equal to x of minus t in a half wave period, then if the signal is satisfying in this condition, then the signal is said to be even symmetric signal. For example, I am considering this signal, I am considering half duration of this signal. So, here I am considering this half period duration from here to here, I am considering like x of t. If you consider x of minus t, so for this the x of minus t is this, these two are same. If you consider x of t and x of minus t, those two are said to be same. Coming to here, coming to odd symmetry, x of t is equal to minus x of minus t. So, that means if you are having x of t, that means I am considering this as x of t. The x of minus t for this x of t is reverse of mirror image of that. So, just we need to fold the signal. This is x of minus t for this x of t. If this is x of t, this is x of minus t. If you want minus x of minus t, then it will reverse like this. So, this is minus x of minus t. So, now you can see if you consider this as x of t, if you consider a half wave period in a signal and if you consider minus x of minus t for that signal, it need to synchronize with the signal. So, you can see it is equal to the actual signal processing. So, now we can say if this signal is satisfying this condition, we can say this is a odd symmetric signal which is having all cos terms, uh, all sign terms. So, in Fourier series representation, this odd symmetric signal is having only cos terms. Now, coming to half wave symmetry, so here to satisfy half wave symmetry, for example, if you consider any half wave duration of the signal, after shifting to 
next half wave position and reverting you need to synchronize with the signal so here you, if you see so if i shifted and reverted that should be equal to your signal process normal signal processing so here you can see i am considering this one i am shifting this one to here and i am reverting i am reverting means so you, you are getting normal signal processing this is synchronizing with the normal signal so this signal will satisfy half wave symmetry and the same way this signal will satisfy odd symmetry also why because if you consider mirror image and reverted you are going to get just odd symmetry same signal that means odd symmetry only you can confuse all odd symmetric sig signals are half wave symmetric signals no not at all all odd harmonic signals not at all this half wave symmetric signals why because if you consider this signal itself if you are shifting this position to here that means like this and reverting reverting means you are going to get like this you are getting this signal no you are not getting this signal but this is odd symmetric signal but not half wave symmetric signal in this signal all cos terms are going all sine terms are going to present then that means sin omega naught t sin 2 omega naught t sin 3 omega naught t so on are going to present now coming to this signal this is satisfying both odd symmetry and half wave symmetry so here both odd symmetry half wave symmetry means here if you consider this signal then you are getting so now so this is odd symmetry why because if you reverted and shifted not shifted if you uh, if you consider x of minus t and you reversed in negative y axis you are getting the same signal or if you shifted and reversed also you are getting the same signal so it is satisfying both odd and half wave symmetry so odd symmetry means so you are having all fine terms but as it is satisfying half wave symmetry also so you are having odd harmonics of odd symmetry that means odd harmonics means sin omega naught t sin 3 omega naught t sin 5 omega naught t will be present in the Fourier series representation coming to here this will covers all cause and it will satisfy this symmetry or not half wave symmetry or not means here you just shift and reverse so if you shifted this to here and you, if you reverted to here so this is having so if you shifted to here and if you reverse then you are getting same signal so this also satisfying both even and half wave symmetry so that's why as it is satisfying even symmetry cos terms are going to present so in that cos terms also as it is satisfying half wave symmetry only odd harmonics of cos terms are going to present odd harmonics means so cos omega naught t cos 2 omega naught t odd harmonics cos 3 omega naught t cos 5 omega naught t terms are going to present in the Fourier series representation for example you may get one doubt what is the even purely even symmetric signal which can't satisfy half wave symmetry for example if you are having any signal like this so you are having any signal like this if you see the signal here it is satisfying just x of t is equal to x of minus t that means so here you are having x of t is equal to x of minus t the mirror image whatever you are having there that is exactly equal so now you can say this is even symmetric signal whatever you are having in your positive side same thing you are having on your negative side so you can say this is even symmetric signal this is even symmetric signal if you want to check for any half wave symmetry if you shifted and reversed that means for example if you are considering this half and you want you need to shift to check half wave symmetry and you need to revert that shifted signal if you reverted that shifted signal these two are not the, the actual is in red ink 
so the shifted and reversed is in black color so these two are not equal so this is not sat satisfying half wave symmetry this is only satisfying even symmetry so for this signal for this signal if you want to represent fourier series representation then only cos terms all cos terms are going to present so all cos terms means cos 0 omega naught t that means a naught also will be presented so here so that means a naught term means cos 0 omega naught t cos 2 cos omega naught t all cos term means all odd harmonics as well as even harmonics cos 2 omega naught t cos 3 omega naught t all cos terms including that constant is also going to present so like this way we need to check symmetry for the signal so if you want to check even symmetry whatever you are having in your right hand side same thing you need to get in negative axis also like this or like this though these signals are said to be even symmetric signal when a signal is satisfying even symmetry when you are representing Fourier series representation it includes all the cos terms so now odd symmetry coming to odd symmetry if the signal is satisfying x of t is equal to minus x of minus t then you can say that is odd symmetric signal so this is purely odd symmetric signal so coming to half wave symmetry so to check half wave symmetry the signal may be either even symmetric signal or odd, odd symmetric signal so here for example, I consider odd symmetric signal to check half wave symmetry. If you consider this signal to satisfy half wave symmetry, this need to satisfy x of t is equal to minus x of t minus t by 2. That means shift and revert the signal. Here just image and revert the signal, shift and revert the signal. So here, here you are not getting you uh, here you are not getting any odd uh, half wave symmetry here here both odd and half wave symmetry are going to satisfy whenever any even symmetric signal or odd symmetric signal is satisfying half wave symmetry then only odd harmonics are going to be present so for example this is purely even symmetric signal all cos terms are going to present this is not pure even, even symmetric signal so this is even symmetric as well as half wave symmetric only odd harmonics of cause are going to present so now this is purely odd symmetric signal so all sign terms are going to present so if you consider this all sign terms sign uh, omega naught t sign 2 omega naught t sign 3 omega naught t so all sign terms are going to present now coming to this signal this satisfying both odd and half wave symmetry so now so in odd odd symmetry also that means in sign terms also as it is satisfying half wave symmetry we are going to consider only odd harmonics of sine wave sine sine signals why we are taking sine terms because of it satisfying odd symmetry that's why we are having only sine in that sign also why we are considering only odd harmonics means it is satisfying half wave symmetry. Like this way we need to trace the answer how this topic is related to gate means. So in gate exam they will give any um, diagram they will give this diagram this diagram this one or this one they will ask what is the Fourier series representation of that signal they will give options in that options without doing Fourier series representation generally how we will do Fourier series representation first of all we need to take the definition of the signal and we need to substitute in trigonometric Fourier series and we need to consider the values of a n b n and a naught we need to substitute a naught b n and a n values again into that uh, general equation then only you are going to get your final result of representation doing that process will nearly take half an hour to trace the answer without any confusion you, you need to apply symmetry for that problem if you apply symmetry if that is purely even symmetry whatever the option is having all custom that you need to select if that is satisfying when a signal is pure symmetry then only a naught will be present why because 
so zero omega naught is also considered as even harmonics so zero omega naught means a naught term when a pure even symmetric signal is there pure even symmetric signal so that constant term will be there constant term will be there for example if you are having this type of signal if you are having this type of signal this is also even symmetric signal but here there is no coefficient there is no constant why because here this is satisfying both even symmetry as well as half wave symmetry then only odd harmonics are going to present in that even terms so but a not require cos 0 omega naught t that is uh, going to vanish so only pure even symmetric signals will have coefficient so all other signals won't have any uh, constant like a naught not coefficient so won't have any constant value like a naught in trigonometric Fourier series representation now coming to here this signal for this signal what is the constant value is nothing but zero so here also constant is zero here also constant value is zero but here you are having some constant value i will tell you in the next classes how we will calculate constant in trigonometric fourier series without using equations and integrations so here this is about symmetry for example in exam if they given any diagram you need to check for even odd and half wave symmetry according to that you need to select the options that means for example if a signal this signal is given you need to select the option which is not having any co constant and which is having all sign terms that means all harmonics in sign terms so like this way you need to solve the problems related to symmetry of the signal